after open heart surgery nine weeks ago, I was diagnosed with a rare cancer called pericardial mesothelioma. And at this stage, there is no cure. Hi guys, Michael and Grace. We're doing this because I think you're probably going to want to know a little bit about your dad, about what your dad has done in life, just things that I may not be able to get to tell you. I think he's probably the, the Prime Minister the country will never have. He does really help. He was far and away the most, one of the most entertaining people uh, to have around and to be around. <laughs> I think if I survived and in a month I was feeling good again, I would be a totally different person. Like I would be so not sweat the small stuff. I'd be so just enjoying every single day with everybody. I'd be so happy, like I couldn't tell you. He lived with such vigor and such intensity that force radiated out of him and into every friendship, every relationship, whether someone knew Jeremy for a lifetime or 10 minutes. He actually took stands that he didn't have to. That was exceptional. Individual bravery is quite special. 